What's going on, y'all? This is Chris Manolan and Squad, your personal ISO chain and fitness vlogging channel. Today, we're going to go over the pistol squat, which may or may not end up being one of your favorite leg exercises on the ISO chain. Let's get into it. For the pistol squat, it's all about balance. Similar to the Bulgarian split squat video that we did earlier, which you can find here. All about balance. It's also all about setup. Okay, so once you find the chain link um, for you, here's how you position it. So without turning the unit on, what you wanna do is first foot placement. You want your foot as close to the spring on the base plate as possible. So you don't want it far, that way you'll be too wobbly. So keep it close to the spring for hand and bar placement. If you can see this, I'm gonna squat down so you guys can see. So you want to create an X like this. So you want the, the bar right on the end of your front delt here, right in between the end of your delt and the beginning of your bicep. Put in that little groove there and create an X. You want to keep the bar here, okay? You want to keep your chin up during the movement. So now what you want to do, you want to get into the final stance of the movement, bringing your leg out, which can be a little tricky. So if your balance is good, this will be a little easier. If it's not, it may be a nightmare. All right, so I'll be doing the pistol squat from the top position. If you want to go into mid or low position, you want to adjust your chain linking accordingly. We have everything set. Extend your leg out here. Push. Ugh. All right, and from side position. That one is tricky. It's all about balance. If a sport you're practicing requires a lot of balance, I highly recommend doing this pistol squat. It can be a little weird. So what I'd suggest doing is setting the iso chain bar and base plate against the wall. So if you do tip over, at least you run into the wall versus falling onto the floor. For breathing, when you're pushing up, you want to exhale the whole time. Just like with any of these other isometric contractions, you always want to be exhaling. Never hold your breath, never inhale during the movement. Making sure that your chin is up while holding the bar here. This movement is great for one, obviously working balance, but it also works the quads, the glutes, the spinal erect. Great for overall leg development, balance, a little bit of core strength as well. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell if you want more ISO chain and fitness vlog videos. Come join the squad. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.